YouTube, welcome back. We are here and we have a great batch of orders to go through. We'll start off at the top. A nice batch of Jordan 1, especially those Storm Blues. That's a shoe you really don't see too often. The Biohack, I'm very happy about going out because you guys remember that shoe used to be going for 250, 300 brand new. Now uh, it's really hard to get 200 new and 150 used. So glad to see those go. We got the five and a half black cements. Nice uh, GS, lightly used pair that's just too classic to pass up. Fears, which I feel like every time we get a used pair and they go quick because we can price them around hundred dollars look at this row right here four peak going on we got a brand new gratitude a used gratitude a used concord and a used concord low this pair of 13s right here i'm a fan of these man a lot of 13s going under the radar right now shout out to romeo who stopped by on saturday he also grabbed the racer blue fives as well as a pair of the air max big bubbles which if you're a smaller size you can grab an air max big bubble women's pair for like 120 or so so that's just crazy to see i believe his name is will shouts to him for grabbing the off-white fives brand new gym red 14 going out next to the air ships shout out to ty from delaware for grabbing that pair of air max 90s this morning via dm speaking of air max is going past the big bubbles we got the purple triax i feel like recently in an episode i was talking about the classic neon blue and pink triax so nice to see those going out wow i mean we just got a nice little row of air maxes the 24 sevens next to i believe those are called the cosmic clay air max 95 going down to the catch a case black air forces which that back in the day was one of the pairs I would get uh, for the whole school year. So, you know, every year I'd either choose like a black Air Force, a white Air Force. Good times. Nice little Air Force batch going down that St. Patrick's Day one. Is St. Patrick's Day coming up? Yes. Mm -hmm. All right, makes sense why that one's going out. It's also kind of high up there on the apps. Los Angeles Cortez Union Pistachios. Happy to see that go because I feel like that pair was just hype got lost on those. Here we got a pair of Dunks. I guess those are called the Giraffes. Kind of like those, pretty nice. Got a pair of Blazers, pair of Space Hippies, which if you guys remember when the Space Hippies first started dropping, it was like a really big deal. All recycled material, very comfortable, very affordable. Got the Wings Fives, a pair you don't see too often. Good packaging, a lot of cool stuff going on, but uh, they just don't sell too well a pair of breads we just put up maybe we underpriced them because they sold like both really fast bad bunny very happy to see that happen because the used pair we've had for quite some time and people just keep making offers and you know pressing by it now but not paying and just like yada 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 so it's funny for both of those to sell in the same day one new one used carbon beluga which again i'm not a easy fan but I, I think that's a pretty nice one it's also really affordable right now that pair is super clean a6 we got the class of 97 pearl foam posits foam runners vapor maxes and check these out guys these are the area 72 all-star speaking of all-star what a crazy all-star game and all-star weekend dame is a dog for not letting Hallen Burton try to get the mvp but at the same time if you're making like half court jumpers i mean you deserve the mvp and other than that that's about it shout out to everyone for shopping with us jake jordan brewing anything for the people about the orders the bad bunnies i know they're not really going for anything but i really do like that uh, model you know response i think all the colorways are pretty fire okay not a big adidas guy but i don't know something about those is just really cool a little funky little, little like early early 2000s late 90s kind of sneakers so i really like those i like the um the pearls one of those phones that you know been looking for a while just can't really seem to find them in decent condition or price but definitely one of those ones when it comes to foams that color is just really beautiful every time i see that shoe i'm not mistaken i believe ray allen wore them and uh he got game it's a classic movie and all that so really beautiful sneaker nice air max is going out big bubble in the 90s see a little trend going on with those two just because of the consistent sales we have with those the 95s again big 95 and I just love that colorway. It's nothing special, but the all black, the hit of orange and tan up top is just really, really fire to me. The GS five and a half BC threes. Really love that shoe. One of my favorite J's of all time. Off white fives. The black pair always, always sell pretty well for us. Always sells really fast for us as well. Just overall, a really nice batch. This is kind of like a nostalgia batch because you got some J's, you got some Air Maxes, and then you go down to some Air Forces. Even got some Cortezes in there. Um, they got a bunch of different trainers. A6 over there in the corner. Not the Keanos, anything like that. Have, but you know the gel lights the classic pairs in my opinion so really nice batch to start the week out a lot of work to do today but really happy 
how we want to start the week. Starting at the bottom, the foam posit pearls. The past couple of years, foam posits. I mean, I guess this, recently they've been having a little bit of a comeback. Depending on the colorway, uh, they're either very easy to sell or very hard to sell. I personally find in my selling experience that the uh, pearls are an easier shoe to sell, even though they don't go for a ton. Red 11s, those move very quickly. Nice shoe, no box, beat, brand new, always a quick seller. Carbon Belugas, that's a shoe that I think, you know, among the just flood of 350s in the past couple of years, that is a shoe that came out and I think people really did like it more than you know the other basic colorways that were coming out um, I think that was a nice reiteration of the you know uh, 1.0 2.0 big bubbles there's not a lot of shoes that are on my radar uh, that I want to pick up for personal at all but the big bubbles is a shoe that I really need in my size I think I need a size 12 in those so if anyone has a size 12 with the big bubbles you're not gonna hear me saying I want one of the a shoe that we have out here but that's definitely one of the ones that I will pick up eventually and beat into the ground at the top we got the fear threes and actually the UNC top both good examples of just the sneaker market recently where if you're a seller it can be kind of tough because both those shoes I think are new are going under retail but especially used I mean we're selling them you know way under retail so it's a type of example where if you're a seller it's tough because you're not gonna be making a lot of money on them but as a buyer now's the time to get the shoe you want even though they're recent releases they're nice colorways and you know back in the day those you know came out well the fear threes did but UNC toes reminds me of the uh, obsidians and the obsidians are still up there you know like four hundred dollars I think right now so just a good example of nowadays if you want a shoe that you've been wanting for a long time you can get it for a great price we can move to the storm blues real quick that's actually an example of a jordan one that still holds its value just because of the classic colorway and uh you know when it came out one of my favorite jordan one colorways honestly and uh definitely e pretty easy seller other than that great variety here like i always say ever since i started working here and just before you know seeing what they would post uh every day that they sold you're not going to find a lot of places that sell as much variety as this yeah i'm gonna start with the storm blues thanks to the biohacks I just remember in the old store, we used to have a shit ton of biohacks. We probably still do. So if you're looking for a biohack now, right now is a perfect time to buy them just because they're at all-time low, especially brand new. Storm Blues, those are, like Jake said, a great shoe, Jordan 1 colorway that still holds its value. And if you can't afford that, you know, Union 1 price for the Storm Blues, it's definitely a good alternative. The quality and overall colorway is just great. Love to see a GS shoe go out, especially those Black Cement 3s. Hopefully the person who gets them enjoys them, beats them to the ground. Love this little variety of Air Maxes over here next to some Air Forces. We always pride ourselves in variety here ton of different air forces ton of different air maxes i want to speak about the airship because the airship is one of the most comfortable sneakers so long as you wear them and um, beat them they pretty much mold to your feet really great and i really like the doubles that we have from the red 11s to the bad bunnies to even like the concord especially like those uh gratitudes really dope to see like doubles of what we have go out and i love these uh little jordan 5 lows don't see jordan 5 lows as often as uh you know back then but glad to see a color like that go out so this is a really dope batch we also got to add the airway ups as well as the court vision lows we also have to add this fire mellow all-star jersey it is all-star season i guess we got an ecw reprint shirt got this crazy uh supreme shirt we got a fitted and we got the classic uh yankee satin gotta make sure to get all this stuff packed up because we do have a ton of work to do today so let's do that asap look for the stuff uh, This one might pass on just because it's got a stuff on it. Where you be buying these from, bro? Hmm? Where you be buying them from? Um, what's the um, spot on Patterson? It's 350. It's crazy for these. Yeah. Same with these. Four. Four is crazy, bro. Like, these shirts are sitting in the mall. That's why I say that's why I say that like you know what I'm saying. You know how many resellers be bro. That's crazy though bro like How much you say you wanted again? Like one thing I should. Like, they get like, they get like 90. I wouldn't even pay that much. Even yeah. if they were in better condition, I wasn't paying that much. Oh, yeah. But with the stuff on the, t on the tone and everything like that, I don't think it can come off with that yeah. material. Yeah. It's like liquid. Be reasonable with me, that's all. Trust me, I'm, 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 I'm going to try my best, bro. I ain't bro. trying to be greedy and shit. Nah, I feel you. 
Why wow, this shit just sitting in Full Locker? I don't want to be going in Full Locker, to tell you the truth. That's bro. the problem, bro. You got you to go to Full Locker. Just go and just see you first before you I go. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're paying three twenty five for these, mm -hmm. three fifty for these, like, 400 uh, 400 for these is not terrible. But for at least these two, these shit's just sitting in that Full Locker. Yeah, to be honest, y'all got some shoes that I want. I'm going to fuck around and come in here and get some. What, what you trying to get? Not right talking? now. I'm just saying I was just browsing and shit. Yeah. I got some heat. Man, we tried them, man. We tried them. So, like, I came up to 420 for these. This one is not included, but I can do 420 for these. Is that 420? Yeah. For what you basically did for? Yeah. Like, 60, 70, basically. Like, these three. This one was at a buck. This one was at a buck 20. And these were, like, 60, 70. These are all on the retail. You got 120 for these? Mm -hmm. You can do a better price for these or no? Nah? How much? Like you said 120 a shoe. Yeah, but I forgot how you can put these in there, to tell you the truth. I'll come up an extra 15, call it 435. Fuck it. Yeah. That's cool. How do yeah. you usually pay your Apple Pay, Zell? Which Apple one? Pay. Apple I'll, Pay. I'll take Zell though. Make sure you come out. Let me see what you brought by. Let's see what we can do. Three fifty trade. I'm not trading. I'm paying cash. Oh, okay. My fault. I saw these. These are. I'm trying to see something else. Oh yeah, three twenty five cash here. Yeah. Ah right, yeah. Now I'm buying this. Oh, I bet, bet, Um, those are elevens. Those Jita. I think I've seen that size. Uh, ten and a half. Ten and a half. Okay. Was it the box pair or no box pair? Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Let's see what I think it's like. Yeah, but I looked at the... Um, I hit my fault. I was looking at the used pair. You saw the one that's the, the, I mean, the used, used pair. pair. Yeah, I thought they were used. Yeah. I don't why, but I guess... Yeah. I've seen that shoe like three times. No box? I want to go on No box. Right. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna be loving them, Yes. Yeah, if you're gonna at 12... This is for my brother. Oh, okay. That's, I was a, that's a birthday gift. All right, 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 right. Okay, yeah, let me know which ones you want to do. Um, y'all could come down on the price on this one. They got scuffs, you know. I mean, I, I'm trying to take both of them. If you want both. Yeah, right. if y'all could, you know, you could uh give me something good. Um, I can do two thirty for both. Uh, what you break that down? How uh, is that? One ten. Um, one th um, one twenty. Or like 115, 115, however you wanna. Yeah, um, I'm gonna pass on these. Yeah, no worries. I'll take these though, definitely. What were you thinking? We're Honestly, gonna... like 90 bucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll probably pass on them. Like I said, yeah. if they were here for a while, I could do a little bit better, but. I mean, if next time I come, y'all still got them. Yeah, of course, yeah. of course. Did you wanna do these still? Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely, All definitely. Right, Let me grab you the box for that one so you can check those out. You can bring this one down to a hundred. I'll take both of them. Well, let me see the other pair first. Yeah, I got the other one. Yeah. What's that? A and a half? Nah, this is a ten. Oh, that's a ten. Yeah, these are definitely take for one ten. Hey, check this one out. Um, how the GS fell? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Right, uh, so these I'm gonna take for sure. Right, not, I'll buy something that will. Uh, you said a hundred? Huh? You, you said you want to do a hundred? Yeah. That's cool. Alright. Uh, these are me. Um, I probably wouldn't want those two, but I'll probably take possibly these. I just gotta look these up. Okay. See what they're going for. Alright. Um, what do you want with Kobe's? Like one? Uh, Cool. How do you like to pay? Uh, card. Card. Right. I'm gonna bring my D when you come there too. And would you like an email, text, print receipt? Uh, text, please. Okay, cool. What's the phone number? Uh, thank you, boss. I appreciate you guys as have always. A good one. Yeah, yeah you too, you guys. Yeah, well, I guess. You said you wanted a hundred for the Kobe's, right? Yeah. These you only want you guys to nah, buy bucks. Nah, we just so backed out with stuff like that. Yeah, honestly, uh, right. I'll probably be like fifty for these. I'll drop those to two for you. One fifty difference. You gonna run that? One fifty. 
Mm -hmm. This should be. That's cool. Let me see. One, two, three, the difference. Yeah, I just compared it to like the pair that we have online. Pretty cool. We're gonna sell for like 100. 250? So yeah, 250 here. I dropped these to 230. Uh, they're at 235. I'll drop these to two. 150 is the difference. You are if you want to run that. So, want 375 total. Because the um, 475 correction with that. Because you're paying cash for that. 325, right? Yeah, plus a 150 to 475. Okay. You want a reflection box for these? Sure. Yeah, let me get you one. 475, you said, Jay? Yeah, uh, 325 and 150. What did you say, Jay? I just said the funny thing about these is that. It's always like Puerto Ricans and Dominicans who always uh, man, nah, nah, It's not man. a bad thing, but it's just, it's just funny because like, it's Jeter, you know, it's the Yankees. I just, you know go, I just go wear them just for the games. <laughs> Whenever I go to games, that's what I'm wearing. This is actually four. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. Nah, it's not, it's not a bad thing. I just find that it's, it's just funny. Like, it's just like, there, uh, you give me four. So how much left I got to uh, nah, I'll eat 25. 25? Yeah, because it's 375 total. Okay. I did. <laughs> <laughs> I need bail that shit. I already do what's happening. It, it was my last hurrah until next season. Oh, oh, I, I was pulling for the 49ers. We all were. It looked like the 49ers was just going for the Chiefs. The Chiefs had an extra, <laughs> uh, extra man slash woman playing for them. Yeah, Kyle Shanahan playing for them. <laughs> it was, it was, it was Yo, bad, man. Jay, thank you. Appreciate you as always. Likewise. Easy yours. I got you. Yes, sir. Enjoy your day. Fellas, take care. Appreciate you, man. Did you see anything online or not? No, not yet. I've been busy. I've been busy, man. Oh, well, you know, you're a busy man. I wish. Maybe I I, I, I got money over here on that side. I be wearing Blinky, Chrome. I don't wear any of that. Gallery. Oh, that's Nick. I don't see that. Partner in crime, man. <laughs> what, what you asking on these three? So these, there's really no market for these. They're also, I got those from Steel. I mean, they're going for Steel, right? Yeah, yeah, I love it. Let's see. Carry twos, what the? There's a no box pair for 223. Okay. Could you do two? And what about the other two Kobe's? These ones, I was at um, 350. And these ones, I was at like 150. I haven't seen the Kobe eat these in so long. Yeah, bye. You said three fifty in the Bruce Lee's? Yeah. But I'm the Bruce It's good. I feel like I'm gonna be at like two for him. Two fifty. Let's see what you have with that other stuff. I was at one seventy. Oh one sixty. <laughs> Trying to get over on me, that's crazy, yo. That is I forgot, crazy. I forgot this one. So like the new Kobe's they're making? Which ones? The um those purple ones that just came out. The eights? Yeah. They're cool. They're not terrible. What's the lowest you want to do on these? What do you think? Do a hundred. Or you can flip a coin. What's the coin? Uh seventy hundred. I feel like I want to be like around fifty for them. Do a fifty seventy coin flip. And how much you say you wanted two for these? Yeah. What's the best you want to do here? Uh, one fifty. I'm gonna take a shot at like seventy-five. Let's do um one twenty eighty coin flip. One twenty. Damn, eighty's looking crazy. One twenty eighty coin flip, and then the fifty seventy coin flip here. You're at two on these. Mm -hmm. Three. And then depending on who loses and who wins. You do um, 220 or 250. So I'm at 325. My numbers for all three. Let's do a 75, 325 coin flip. That's pretty good. <laughs> That's pretty good. I'll come up total like 340. 350. Mizal. <laughs> 350, Mizal. Uh, <laughs> I'll do 350. 300 coin flip. Nah, I can't do that. I 350, can't do 325 that. then. 350, 325. Hmm. Yeah, that's cool. Touch tails. Uh, I call in the air. air. I call in the air. <laughs> call in the air? Alright. Tails. Yes! I love this. Yes! 
<laughs> you wanna go next door first or you wanna? Yeah, I'm gonna go next door. I bet. Just let me know. Pleasure doing business as always. I bet. Is all? <laughs> <laughs> How much were you looking for everything? I don't know, man. I'm just trying to get. I'm just trying to get offers. So like maybe four or five of them will be used. You're just trying to get offers, you said? Yeah. I mean. I mean. Uh, whatever. Whatever. I mean, I know you all gotta make money on them. So. I'll kind of like. I'll kind of like to know. I kind of like roughly where you're at. Sorry, no. Honestly, I I haven't looked at anything. It's, Are you it's, trying to sell everything today? I'm trying to sell everything. Right? Okay. Cool. Yeah, I haven't. I haven't looked at. I know sometimes people say I'm trying to hear offers and I'm not trying to sell them. Oh, no, no, no. If I, would, <laughs> I, would not, I would not go to my car and grab all of these. I wasn't trying to sell them. If it's fair, I'll, I'll take them to be honest. I'm not. I would probably say, you know, as I'm going through this stuff, uh -huh. see where you'll be at roughly. Estimate if you could. Um, I'm not gonna talk to you. I, I I didn't do it. I didn't look up none of this. I was just I'm cleaning out my apartment. Okay. And I just grab all of this. I didn't look at none of the prices. All right. I know I got some of them that is worth a lot, but some of them are regular. Too. Quality that you have is not bad too. Good size. Yeah. So that's that's good. That's gonna be in your favor for sure. This one I might keep. I'm not gonna. This one. Let me put this one to the side for now. Yeah. All right. I'll see what we can do. Yeah, fourteen fifty for everything. Let's we'll see a breakdown. I think I was around like 240 here. This one was around like 60, 70. Uh, St. John's was at like 100. Uh, 100 here. 50 on the unions. Um, Set 50 on who? The Cortez, Union Cortez. Okay. It's the Heritage, Heritage. I was around like 70, 80. The Vaults, Air Forces, um, Vault Dunks. I was at 50 here. I forgot where I was at for the other two, the Travis Scott's and the Hirachis. I was around like two for the Off-White. Lots and 50 for the share cues. You said you got 14.50. Yeah, and then do you want to sell the other ones? How much are you going to do for these? Uh, let's see. If we have 14.50. That's so great. Then they ain't going for sure. They're not bad. Right? They're like, they value between like one, one, 120 to 140. It's okay, I can, I can move this one out. Okay. Um, you want to do 17? Uh, probably want to be able to do 17, uh, 17. I feel like the best I could probably do is like 15. Come up 50 and then we go. I want to be at 15, honestly. Like this, there's a few good ones. Like mm -hmm. these are good, these are good. Mm -hmm. These two, maybe the off-whites are like the three best shoes. Again, everything in here, after that, it's all under 200, you know? So it makes it a little bit uh, difficult to come up a little bit more. On the price, and so I can do 15 for you. Come up that 50, and then we go. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna come back. I got it's 15, just 15 man. It's just 50 bucks. Gee, boys. All right, bro, be Gee, easy. Bro. You know, in this economy, 50 dollars a lot of money, man. <laughs> a lot of money. 50 dollars a lot of money. Bro. Come, come up that 50 bucks for me. I gotta be staring at that fifth, that 15. I have to. All right, let's do it. I'm already here. I told you I'm, I, I, I'm already here, so it's not like. Right. I mean, I get no pressure. Like I don't. Uh, yeah, no, no I don't pressure. You, I don't know if you feel like you have to take that number. No, no, no. Um, so good. Uh, you have Venmo, Zelle, Apple Pay. I uh, do Zelle. So. Okay, cool. You just spend all this on Nike and stuff like this. Yeah, it's it's all from Nike. Uh, some some are from yeah, like you see the Z mm -hmm. tags from StockX. And stuff. StockX. A couple of them from StockX, but. Okay. And the jersey. Uh, thirty-five. Okay, I could look into the jersey. I'm not really sure because I know he's kind of like yeah. might get traded type yeah. shit. Okay, um, and the shoes. Um, okay, let me see. 
A two. Doesn't sound too crazy. Um, the mochas. Um, one ninety. I want retail. Gotcha. Do like one seventy. One eighty. The phones, how much are you out there? Uh, like I said, 30. I mean, my bad, these phones, sorry. Oh. Um, like, I was hoping about 120 because it's with the box, and like, I don't know, I feel like you really don't see people with these anymore. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're. And they're in really good condition, so when you roll them like twice. <laughs> they're not too bad. Do they have the yep. tag? Yep. Oh, nice. I got the receipt from where the place I bought it. Sweet. And uh, the chutneys? Uh, 80. I clean them up as much yeah, as I could. Yeah, chutneys are just tough because like, I like them, but they don't really sell too yeah. well. Um, so you want it to be at 190 here? Or what did you say, 180 yeah, here? Yeah, 180. So 30 each here I think is okay. okay. 200 on the black cement's cool. The mocha's interesting. I know brand new, they're really high, but like, use are kind of at like 180, 190, 200. I don't know if you could do like 170 and 110. And the chutneys I feel like would be super low, so I don't yeah. know if you want to keep those, but. This, uh, I can double check. I just feel like we'd be in like the, this kind of ballpark for these. Mm -hmm. Like 30 or something like that. I'll do your deal if you could put uh, 10 extra on these, if possible. It's so like 40. Okay, um, let me just check on that jersey because I feel like we might just pass on the jersey. Okay. So you wanted to do, you said 110 is cool here mm -hmm. and 170 is cool here mm -hmm. and you 200 and then you just want 40 here. Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess that's cool. So we'd owe you 580. Mm -hmm. um, Early, like 30 bucks, I'll get like. It's, it's a city jersey, so. Yeah, I would uh, make it 600 even with the jersey. That's, that's great. Yeah, okay, I'll, I'll do it. Give it a try there. Um, can you, do you guys give me like some cash and then some of uh, Zell possible? So it's 600, right? Yeah. That's exactly around the ballpark I was looking for. Thank you. Nice. Glad that worked out. It was a uh, very hectic day today. We had a lot of work to get done. We also have a lot of new work to get done because we bought like, over $7,000 worth of shoes. So it's just been pretty hectic. Shouts to everyone who pulled up, traded something, bought something, sold us something. We greatly appreciate it. We definitely have a lot of work to do this week in store. I have a lot of work to do on content. There's a lot of stuff going on. So hopefully, you know, tomorrow we wouldn't mind a nice slow day so we can get a lot of this work done. But again, shouts to everyone who's been pulling up. It's been quite the crazy day in the last couple Couple weeks about it for me it's cold and I'm ready to go home so we will go to the one and done as you can see we have a pile of sneakers that we didn't even get to this is all brand new stuff that we need to list I'm a little overwhelmed but it's okay one and done see you guys tomorrow oh YouTube what is good we are back and as you can see we have a nice little batch of orders right here we're gonna start off at the top we got a couple Jordan 4's the taupe haze is one that's a lot more rare for us brand new nowadays lightnings we have quite a few here we got the fragment 3 I honestly wasn't a fan of that sneaker until you know it just had to grow on me that yellow back tab in my personal opinion makes the sneaker a lot better and it's funny to think about how when I had the grand opening at Provo Square I remember talking about how one day they're gonna do a white cement 3 with a yellow back tab have and yelled soul and that's exactly what the reimagined three is but i feel like the fragment they kind of take an ode to that having the back tab that gets yellowed over time got the ama 12 and i was thinking about this earlier how that sneaker you know it's a lot of bang for your buck obviously you get the suede you get the leather what do you call this like a box cover you get the keychain all that stuff and they're still going for like 80 to 100 dollars under retail definitely get a lot of bang for your buck with the keychain with the box cover as well as the leather and the suede we got the unc dunk low which i feel like it's going for a lot less than they used to go for i feel like that was a 500 450 shoe especially in that size 11 and a half now it's about 350 we got the diplomats dip set hat heading overseas actually very cool hat obviously i grew up in that era dip set d block g unit so it's a uh, special close to my heart right there we got a red skins old snapback all-star sixes let's talk about this row red thunders we got the air hawks brand new where and when do you ever see air hawks at a sneaker store especially brand new we got the air flight 89 
times, I believe, in a cool colorway. Beluga's new with no box. We got the Jordan All-Star jersey from a few years back and the crazy Michelin S Piper's jersey. Berwin, anything for the people about the orders? Yeah, I'm gonna start with these two just because I know we just got them recently. Didn't think they were gonna fly out that fast, but you know, with due time and the amount of listings we've been posting lately, I'm glad those are going out. I remember those UNC dunks. People used to fiend for those when dunks used to be hot. People would willingly pay four to five hundred for those, uh, especially when those just came out. I remember at the old store, we were selling those a lot alongside the Michigan State and especially the Pandas as well, so that's a good memory to have. And these Belugas, remember when the first release came out, people were feeding for that colorway as well, but then ever since the re-release, me, if I were to pick any 350 right now to wear, it'd probably be that one for sure. And the Tote Force, I really like that sneaker. It's kind of like a cheap friends and family Travis Scott. I feel like it's one of the better colorways of the Jordan 4s, especially since it's neutral tone, so you could definitely get away with a lot of fits with those. I'll shout to everyone who's been ordering off the eBay. We have a lot of stuff and shoes to go through, so definitely check out our website. Definitely check out the eBay, definitely check out the YouTube. Shouts to y'all for the support. We have a lot of work to do these next couple days. Me personally, hopefully I can finish my sneaker con video by this weekend, but really don't know. Anyways, we're gonna pack up all this stuff and get it shipped out ASAP. What are you asking all this stuff? Yeah. One thirty. Which one? This one? Yeah, one thirty. This is like eighty. This is around two two thirty. What's he doing? That's new? Yeah, you can check it out. Yeah, I'm gonna go for some. I know they don't go for much, so... Let me see. Is this a recent release, or...? No, this is... Oh, it's brand new, though. So this guy, I'll probably pass on it. Just because... The clothing for us has been slow. And when it comes to Supreme, I will take, like, certain things, like... The North Face stuff, which is, like... Certain collapse. And then we got it. Yeah, you said 230 here, you want it? Yeah. I'm just trying to get rid of it. I pulled it for too long. And Went down, right? Yeah, I tried something, but it's not working. Yeah, it's pretty tricky. I've been trying to, like, yeah, the like, market. Yeah, it's it's like cool. one second, you, you see a low number. Yeah, and then and it goes then up out of nowhere. And back down. Yeah. When selling it, it was kind of difficult because I try to do it on my own sometimes. Yeah. yeah. Any offers you got on, on your own? Not really. Because I'm, I'm in the military. So oh, you don't have time. So not really. All. I don't really. When I do have time, I just I come home sometime with my family, so I don't really. Yeah, like it's a tricky market. I'm not gonna lie. Like. Mm -hmm. Just anyway, I'm just trying to get rid of them. For like I feel like I will probably want to be at like 250 for both. About um, 200 for both. 200. Yeah, it's so like. 50 and 150 here. Like I said, the market on this one is really, really weird. So just seeing the sales of like 170, mm -hmm. 180, it's kind of what's like. Mm -hmm. It's not like 230 for both? Uh, what I said, two? Yeah. Um, I would do 220 for both. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, that's cool. Um, what's the best way for you? Um, Zell, Apple Pay, uh, Venmo. Zell. Zell. Okay, cool. I'm pretty sure you guys have my information. I've been coming in. Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, I've been in I've seen you before. Yeah, I'm yeah, sure. Uh, they're both brand new. What are you asking on these? That's a great question, man. And I do. Um, I don't know. Uh, like two seventy. Or <laughs> which? Oh, no. Okay, two seventy five. Yeah. And how much for this one? That one. It's like four fifty. Is there anything else you're asking for? No, that was pretty much it. I'm just gonna. Okay. Would you say here again? Uh, uh, I believe I said 180. Like, like, wait, was it 180? Yeah, 180 plus 270. Yeah, I was looking for 450 for both. Okay, so I'm gonna have to that far off. I was at 4 for both, so 350. Because it seems like they're on the rise. Like, yeah. These are just like a lot less desirable. Yeah, the, the white one though. Can't do 440. Yeah. Oh, I like to be at 420. Yeah. 420. 
It's just this one is just not. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that one's not probably. It's a nice color with it. No, it's yeah, it's just, it's just yeah. like. The hype not really we, we probably like in totality of like getting them probably bought this specific color like <laughs> at least like 10 pairs really? probably so like three of them four of them maybe yeah. yeah it's like i mean obviously this is the one yeah it's like one. better yeah. um this one's just a lot harder to move mm -hmm. but i could do 420 for you if you would like that you do for for the 435 425 430 Four two five. Four dirty. Four two five. Four dirty. Four, 30 four two five. Four two five is a nice number. It's a nice, it's a nice strong number. I think four thirty is a nice number. Four thirty just sounds sleepy. Four twenty five sounds strong. Four twenty sounds sleepy. Yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> um, would you do any like coin flip or something? What you want coin flip? Four fifty four hundred. Oh, oh, you don't feel good stuff. <laughs> We going for the goose though. Just throwing out big you say now. I'll do 430, 420. 440. 410. I'll do 440, do four. Oh, so instead of 450, you do 444? 444. Or you just take the 425. I'll do uh 445, 400. I'll do the um 440, 400 coin flip. You want to do that? Yeah, All right, you want to call it now? You want to call it in the air? Uh, um, I'll do 440. This is a National Park coin. It has a bat on it. It has tails. The regular. Who is this guy? George Washington. Uh, I'll go with. Give me heads. You want heads? Yeah. All right. That's a terrible flip. Sir, that was a terrible flip. They got no spin. All right. Um, what's the best way for you? Is that right? Yeah, it was cool. Uh, I know I lost last time. So I'll take that. Hey man, it comes back. It is 6:57. Did one last buy. Today was really slow, but that's a good thing because we got a lot of pictures done. Got a lot of stuff from eBay because that's been really stressful lately. I'm not gonna lie, just the pictures and get anything up online try to maneuver all that but you know slowly but surely we're, we're almost there a little pile of hair got more stuff next door that we gotta get to hopefully the inventory numbers come in tomorrow so we can put those on the shoes get them inventory into the system put them away yeah shout out to everyone who's purchased something shout out to everyone making you know good offers shout out to everyone who's been selling us the bread force if you guys have any pairs hit us up via dms call us we're buying all sizes basically at least men's sizes again if you have pairs hit us up let us know how much you're looking for it with the size but yeah yeah, thank you for having a slow day so we can kind of catch up on a lot of work um but still have a lot of work to do crazy crazy week but looking forward to it yeah shout out to everyone who's been coming by i've been going through countless 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 pictures of uh new stuff used stuff no box stuff as you guys can see you gotta go through that pile right there um and we still got more shoes next door so i'm pretty excited to almost be done with everything don't forget to check us out at topdropkicks.com currently being updated as we speak new stuff is being put every other hour every day so so definitely check us out. If you want to go through us directly, give us a call or DM us on Instagram. One and done. Catch y'all Friday. Here we go. Oh, not even close. YouTube, what is good? We are back. Today is a very special day. Best day of the year, February 23rd. And we have a great batch of orders right here. Where do I begin? I guess we'll start off at the top corner. Bread toes, you see that glitter on them. Brand new, prices definitely came down from what they were at, but it is what it is. We got two pairs of Jordan 2s, Mellow 2s, 11 and a half, and J Balvin 2s, 11 and a half. These are always crazy to me. Still lighting up too. That's really cool. Didn't even put that in the listing, so the buyer will be happy about that. This is a different used pair of Reimagined 3s, but I was reminded of that because yesterday, Yesterday we sold a size nine. A kid came in. We had him in the store for 250. He asked uh, if we could do 200. We said 230. He was like, "Oh, market's 200." I'll be like, "Sorry, man. I guess uh, we can't make a deal." And literally the next day they sold for 245 on eBay. So it's always nice to see that happen. And it sucks that sometimes customers walk out of here thinking that like we're overcharging when in reality we're usually like right around what we're supposed to be charging. Obviously there's occasions where we could go a little lower, a little higher, but it is what it is. That's business. Speaking of that's business, we got the red cement fours. You guys know what I've been doing with those prices 
devices are kind of all over the place. I was editing my San Antonio video all day and night yesterday. And uh, one thing about those fours is a lot of people are asking 250, 280, 300, 350, 220. It's like one of those shoes that's all over the place. So kind of get what you can get from. Speaking of Jordan 4s though, these green olive canvas 4s, man, I, I actually think these are one of the better releases from Jordan brand. I just feel like they don't really do this type of colorway too often. So it's definitely something different and it could be one that shoots up in the future. You never really know. Free 99 dunks, definitely not a fan of those. Acid wash dunk highs, not a fan of those either. You know, these aren't terrible, I guess, just because I like when Nike does something different and you know, with the different box and the presentation and the leathers and the shape and stuff like that, it is cool. It's just uh, these really went down in value for sure. Speaking of down in value, we spoke about the Ama 12s, Cherry 12s. Every time we get those in here or use, they always sell. Cement 11 lows, Chile reds, playoff eights, Raptor fours, which go for the high. We got the end of struck. Dennis Rodman's right there. Brand new. Shouts to TJ from Texas on the purchase. We got some LeBron threes, LeBron eights. Next to the more than an athlete, LeBron 17s. That's crazy how they all sell on the same day. Speaking about crazy, the LeBrons we had on our eBay page, lower than they sold for on GOAT after fee. So it just goes to show you that uh, we definitely got to work on our cross listings. Go with Dome, Foam Posit, Crazy Blue Boots. Happy to get that box out of here because it was all messed up and it was just like sitting at the top of the stack. We got two Supreme Blacks Air Forces, one new, one used. That's crazy. Going down to the Supreme Gremlins jersey, which is super fire. And once we got that in, I went on eBay and actually found one in my size because big fan of the Gremlins. And uh, that's just like a piece right there. Two New Balance, Griffies, Foam Runners. I mean, look at this array. We got the Pro Model Highs, 992s, and the 97s. And that is mostly everything that sold yesterday. Berwin, Jordan, anything for the people about the orders? Before we do the orders, it's not just February 23rd. It's his birthday, so he's trying to It's his birthday, you know? You know, you gotta, you gotta celebrate, you know, surviving another life, you know, new year. Birthday means new chapter, more prosperity, better health and all that. So, you know, happy birthday, A. You know, he's usually really modest about it. He always try to hide it, but, you know, not over here. We wanna make sure we, you know, everyone knows it's his birthday. So, happy birthday, A. Shout out to everyone who purchased some orders today. Really nice bash. There's a lot of different shoes, a lot of colors I'm looking at. Brett saw a Mellow 2, a Balvin, Red Cement 4, White Cement 3, Craft 4, a lot of good stuff. I really like the Playoff 8s. I think that's a really, really great shoe. I see like Jordan Brands are kind of like reimagining or bringing everything back. So, I really like the way they did that shoe. Cement Gray Lows. I think that's an 11 low that doesn't get enough spotlight because I think that's a really good one. Just a white and gray. You know, Jordan 11 low that you can dress up, dress down. I'm on 12 for some reason. We've been selling them lately and like in the past we've couldn't. So, it's kind of happy to see we kind of so like three within like the last week or so. So, really happy about that. The Dennis Ramens, the End of Struck. Those are just super fire. Just remember getting those like two weeks ago and just seeing those. It's just like we don't always get those. So, whenever we do, it's kind of always like a good moment because we know like that shoe's going to sell pretty well and whoever's going to buy them kind of knows that sneaker. Got a couple of LeBrons going out with LeBron 3s. I really like their earlier pairs of LeBrons in my opinion just because they were just like really cool to me. The foam posit boots finally saw the second one. That pair is just really fire. You guys know us. We've been talking about foam posits a lot lately and you know seeing that with the with the ACG boots is really really fire. Flax or we Air Forces really really clean. One new one used. A lot of new balances going out. The Adidas Pro Models was a fire. Shout out to everyone who purchased everything. Yeah again shout out to A. Goat's birthday. A lot more life. More prosperity. With that being said great day of orders. Let's talk about these Flax Air Forces. I think it's a really good fall sneaker. It's like a more lower toned chilled out Timberland in my opinion. If you don't want to get that boot but you want to get something more like calm that's definitely the way to go. All the fours if you don't want to pay that undefeated four price that's definitely a great shoe especially if you just throw on some orange laces. White Cement threes glad to see those go out as always. Love to see Mellow twos go out. That's one of my favorite colorways of the twos. I want to speak about the Jordan 8 playoffs because recently some dude came in. We didn't have a size 12 up but he called to see if we had a size 12 and when we did he was mad geeked. I made sure to like come in the next day or the like two days after when he came in bought the shoes took him out the back to look at them again that was really dope because like we could really tell that he really appreciated those so shout out to you man if you're watching this hope you enjoy those and the end of Strucks, love seeing that shoe go out always new and use every colorway i'm glad we're a sneaker store that carries that type of stuff because i'm pretty sure a lot of sneaker stores don't even know what that shoe is so that's pretty far how we have like a classic 90s basketball shoe right there and i just love seeing lebrons go out because we barely sell lebrons i'm really glad to see a pro model go out because we have a ton of color ways of these so if you're looking for some pro models hit us up i just want to harp on what berwin said about the playoff eights it's really awesome that we can again provide that feeling for our clientele and we've built a clientele that knows that you know we curate a lot of these special sneakers right special jerseys special t-shirts hats whatever it is
is, but especially sneakers, it's always nice to see that type of reaction. Speaking of that type of reaction real quick, is there a shoe off the top of y'all heads that y'all would want to see reimagined? I'll start. I, I think the Raptor 7 with like a super buttery suede like the 2002s or even a leather, that would be my go-to for a reimagined shoe. I'd love to see oh, those back. Varsity Red 6s. Yeah. Those they said might be coming back, hopefully, right? It is. Yeah. That's exactly that's how they're going to look. They that's really say, sad, yeah. but I think that that's one. That's a good one, yeah. You got to bring those back. Yep. That's like, you know, a lot of people I talk to who like infrared sixes. I spoke to someone the other day about it. I think it was like last weekend. He asked about it. I was just like, nah, we don't got them. Just trust me, I'm waiting for those two. But yeah, that's like that that's red, really that good. that new bug. Oh man, that that's the one for me for sure. I would probably say Bugs Bunnies because like the, sh the way those are shaped, I kind of would like to see newer Bugs Bunny with like better leather or like a better shape to play off eight. So that'd be dope, you know? I, yeah. I really like the, be the Bugs Bunny too. That would be fire. It's always nice to see Jordan Brand doing this like thicker, somewhat better leather, even though the bread for leather, you know, it's kind of like on the fence. Some pairs are better than others, but it is what it is. Anyways, we got a lot of content and a lot of stuff to put up. So, oh, oh, God. oh. Stuck, be real, real fragile. It's <laughs> <laughs> really fragile. Gee whiz. <laughs> We got our bag this year. We did well, a little something different. Uh, you know? <laughs> fragile. Look at this thing. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking fragile. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey. Hey. Damn, we're gonna eat that. So. <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I was like, what am I doing? <laughs> what kind of cake is that? Chocolate fudge. Ooh. He always talks about, and he preaches by, especially like when I first started here, and when we used to go to Dunkin' a lot. I always say like, give me a triple chocolate donut, because that's the chocolate best glaze, one. Chocolate, Cho chocolate, chocolate glaze. Chocolate glaze donut. So that is the best that, donut. That was, that was the best one. No cookie cake this year. I know, like, small cake. I know we're all trying to watch our figures. Like <laughs> so, you know? <laughs> nice, nice. Let's take some cake, as long as you guys have some. You know, but uh, yeah, shouts to all y'all too out there watching because without y'all this wouldn't be possible Obviously, it's a blessing to uh, come here every day and uh, do these videos make this content and sell these shoes and buy these shoes And you know, sometimes it, it's rough and uh, it's a lot of work especially lately for me personally But you know again, I, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else you guys out there who support us You guys are the best you're like my family So I greatly appreciate all y'all because a lot of y'all been um, already telling me happy birthday It's not even my birthday yet so today. <laughs> so greatly appreciate all y'all for the support consistently um it's amazing so yeah let's get to work what are you asking of these two uh so these don't have to bother but okay I, and look good i was mad about the brim do you show the, the, the desert work paper in the day fit, you know, yeah <laughs> did you guys sell them we still got them like we, oh, we really? sold them and then they do like complain and how you cancel so but we, yeah we still have i think they're actually what are you asking on these guys? Uh, I would do 450 for the two pairs. 450 for the two pairs. And how much for for just these? Uh, I mean, I'd, I'd like to just sell them together. Okay. How much you say you want again? There's like a bag. 450? Yeah. Probably pass on that, honestly. I feel like I'll be way off. What are you thinking for both pairs? Well, these are pretty cut. I feel 165, so the dunk high is just don't move, so like, I wouldn't really do that heavy. The same with these, just no extra braces, no yep. zip ties, nothing like that. Oh, um, again. Like I would take a chance on these at like three fifty. I wouldn't even be that high, honestly. I feel like I would try to get like three or less on them, so I probably would just pass. Have you tried putting them on eBay or anything like that? Nah. I would try that, honestly. I think that one might be a best bet. So not even 250? No, nah, I wouldn't be that high for both. I was probably thinking like, maybe like two for both. Honestly. I would do that. I don't you want to do that? Yeah. All right. Yeah, you're the only one I'm calling if you get them. I'll make sure to give you a call and let you know if you... What's the best way? Uh, cash. Cash, you don't have Venmo, Zelle, anything like that, Apple Pay. Cash would just be easier. It's just always so busy, yeah. With the Nike outlet there? Yeah, yeah, it's just... 
Cool. Thank you. No problem, bro. Have a good weekend. You too. Have a good weekend. Ooh, it's been quite the day. We've been inventorying all day. We've been organizing all day, taking pictures all day, dealing with customers all day, in store as well as on the phone, via DM, email, all that stuff. I feel like we didn't get a lot of content, but that's okay because tomorrow's Saturday. We'll probably get a bunch of content then. And again, we just are really playing catch up here. I've said this once or twice. You know, it's great to be around sneakers, clothing, all that great stuff, but like, this is a real job. This is real work. And sometimes it does get overwhelming, especially for me when I feel like I have to do so many things and it's very difficult content with the pictures with the drafts with the returns with the organization with the having to buy this build this and uh, make more space and bring stuff here it's just uh, crazy so all you entrepreneurs out there tip of the cap because you know it, it, it is difficult and uh, shouts to Berwin and Jordan and Jake as well um, who hasn't been here the last couple of days but you know they've been helping out tremendously as well because without them obviously it'd be a lot more difficult to get all this stuff online for you guys get all this content out for you guys and everything like that so as you can see i mean i don't know if we spoke about it but we got just a lot of shoes man at this point we hold the gold medal for variety i definitely pride myself on being one of those sneaker stores that people walk into and just like see things they haven't seen or things they haven't seen in a while or just stuff that i know other places aren't going to try to sell like i know you'll not walk in a lot of places and see a shack gnosis next to a union next to a kobe chaos next to an off-white next to a used air raid piece edition like some things I just know and uh, it's really cool and I don't know about these guys but I'm ready to go home because it's been a long day probably gonna do that right probably wrap it up check out the eBay store because we got a ton of stuff up there and the YouTube <laughs> <laughs> what's so funny <laughs> what are y'all looking at <laughs> I think Ron got something for you oh god uh, here shit. we go with the bullshit you're getting that first or the cake first you're getting off with the cake okay I'll be right back just some words about A you guys hear it feels every birthday so I'm gonna keep this very short very uh, simple I wanna shout out to A cause come a long way as far as the first store I went to which was on Roseland for me to go with him at the journey at Provost was really dope and then for me to come here to open this store and kinda be a part of the making of this store was really dope so I'm, I'm really happy that he had me involved in the whole process I'm really happy that I'm gonna have spent another birthday with him and another great year of just business content making new connections making new videos making new sales opening new boxes I can't think of him enough he's taught me a lot about business being a people's person or just being a good human being to people so I've learned a lot from him and I want to thank him a lot for all that because without him I wouldn't be here today every year it's so hard to get him something because like he has everything literally you kind of have to like <laughs> really really think hard about what he likes or what he doesn't like and stuff like that I don't know if you'll like it as much but I thought it was kind of related to the store in a sense so hopefully this helps that's another hint I'm not entirely sure you'll be using it here or at your crib but i hope this benefits the store just as much as it'll benefit the business so i'm really happy i'm able to spend another year giving you something and spending another year to celebrate you so happy birthday man thank you man and uh here you go appreciate <laughs> it thank you for all the help and uh, everything it's not the yeah. craziest gift but hey man the gift's a gift so I i'm appreciative <laughs> everything wow what is this so it's a google nest wow that's pretty cool <laughs> so basically when you're setting up the store they put up cameras wi-fi and stuff like that so with that you can basically control everything even if you have cameras at your house too you can do it there you can do it here Far, and it's mobile man. too so you can take it anywhere and you can play music on it yeah you can put music on it you can check the weather you can play youtube on it it's pretty dope and like i said you, you can control the cameras and stuff that's so you don't sick. really have to like watch a c computer and you that's know, dope man thank you so much yeah so i hope it benefits yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> Stop <on> use, man. <laughs> Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I didn't get something else. It's <laughs> very close to that. <laughs> My turn. A few words of wisdom. You know what I'm saying? Shout to A because you know, you know, fresh out of college, this was like my first. Well, the only job basically. Like, like this is like my out of college job. COVID happened and stuff like that. So I wasn't even going to apply. I didn't even see the job application stuff like that. My boy sends to me, and I did it for like shits and giggles, like not thinking I was going to get it, and then do an interview, and then still not thinking I was going to get it, and then like looking back at it, thinking about one of my in the interview like i probably should have gotten it because i remember you said like if you had like ten thousand dollars a certain amount of money what would you buy i think i said something like chicago ones <laughs> <laughs> I, said, I said like chicago one just like something crazy i don't remember some, some, I, said, I said something dumb sorry. you was like oh maybe you want to try something else like maybe i don't know like a bunch of this and that i was like oh yeah that, that, that's that sounds a lot smarter than what i was thinking <laughs> <laughs> no shout out to a for taking a chance on me because a lot of this was new i learned as i went along I'm still learning as i you know i go along a lot of guys you don't know a you know i think the store really resembles you know who he is and what he likes family friends 
fans, basketball, wrestling, stuff like that. So everything just speaks to what he likes. And since day one, I was a customer, he's been very passionate about this stuff. I've seen the journey. I've seen the journey when it was just him by himself. And we would just be in the store for hours, just talking, trading, just doing just like, you know, just cool stuff. Honestly, just good business. That was one of the reasons why I always felt like the drive was always worth it because I felt like the experience and the customer service was always there. Going to a store and knowing that you're not gonna get taken advantage of and you're gonna get like the best deal possible. You're gonna try to work with you and everyone's happy, everyone wins was always like the best feeling. Just to see the, the grind and the struggle, I think that's like the beauty, just seeing the struggle, seeing how far he's come along, seeing, you know, being in that little store, switching the design, not having space, getting the warehouse, then being there, and then outgrowing that, you know, the team growing and coming here. And, you know, a lot of you guys don't know, like, I feel like the summer was just so stressful because this was like a huge, huge step because running two stores, essentially three if you count the warehouse, more bills and stuff like that. But again, that's like no one else's problem but ours. And every day we just come here and we see how hard he works. He's here six out of the seven days of the week. Sometimes he's here every day out of the week. He's an extremely hard worker. And I think that rubs off on everyone here. We're here with Jake when Jake said it. We got introduced how like he models his business after A. And I truly agree to that because again, like I've learned so much here that I take it out into the real world. We've had so many talks about just like real life and just about focusing on like certain things, the bigger picture, the end goal. Like there's always like something bigger, you know, once you achieve something. So I think just having someone like that in your corner who pushes you and makes sure you know what's the best for you i think it's really important you know i feel like that's the only way you're going to be able to move up in the world is just having those people around you practice what they're talking about every day is not easy but again like you know just being here and just being able to understand like what the end goal is and what the mission is makes it a lot easier since like last summer just having to you know find new people and stuff like that was really stressful on him you know it's stressful on us too but more so on him because you know he's the one who's gonna make these decisions and stuff like that for him it's been like it's been really stressful honestly since like june of last year it's been like a really Really stressful time a lot of guys don't see it but to see the journey that he's been on especially these last couple months has been really dope to see the store just seeing everyone coming to the store saying wow i really love the store this store is really beautiful it's better than the other store i think it's really dope because again we were only supposed to have one store and we took a leap of faith and opened two stores so really thankful to be a part of this journey of youtube and you know, helping build his you know sort of his home basically you know this is his his other home this is his child so to be able to you know when he goes to san antonio or to florida and when he asks burn our to run the store for him while he's gone we really take that with like a lot of pride because you know this is his child and this is everything so we try to you know run the store and treat everything as if it's ours because again like you know we're, we're a team here and again we try to capture his vision as much as possible because again like 10 plus years in the making and see how far he's come and all the people who said couldn't do it or you won't last long and to see like how strong the store is and the support and stuff like that is like it's really really dope to me honestly because like i feel like i relate to him a lot you know it's kind of hard to give him a gift every year because again you don't know what to get him because he has a lot of things and literally every shoe like i thought about different sneakers i'm like oh, that's not good enough he got that or he got something similar to that so with a you kind of gotta like really listen to him because like he won't ever tell you what he wants just kind of like you gotta catch it this gift i kind of caught it honestly like i caught it in the summertime and then like just like lean it up to your birthday it's like what should we get you and stuff like that you know i feel like this is something that will benefit you in the store and i think it's just gonna enhance things that's what i'll say like i think it will enhance things but i think Think this is gonna help you a lot you know make things a little bit easier on yourself when you do you know a certain thing so that's for you thank you sir yes Appreciate sir you. um before i open this up I, I just have to say again like jordan said this has been like 10 years in the making it's just crazy to be where we're at today and as stressful and as hard work as it is it's great to be here I look at these guys as like my brothers i don't need gifts you know what you guys provide for me seriously honesty loyalty letting me know how y'all feel working hard commitment being on time all those things are is really what's important to me and just you know being there for the the brand for me is truly important so you know the gift you know that's really what uh, is important to me and you guys have shown it for years you guys work really hard who knows where the business would be without you guys right like you know I can't do this myself I used to do it myself right now it's bigger than me you know like I, I can't uh, manage it all and we have so many great supporters out there you guys are all the best as an entrepreneur like 10 plus years you know you lose a lot of friends there's a lot of things that I have to do to make my business grow and put the work in having these guys around every day it feels like family like I said they're, they're like my brothers to me and that's important
important, right? Because, you know, business is business, but at the same time, like you guys have been here through a lot of it, you've witnessed it, like like Jordan was talking about the stressful situations that aren't on camera, um, the shit that we deal with at the end of the day, like we deal with a lot of shit, putting ourselves out there into the world with content, we deal with a lot of stuff like that, and that gets extremely stressful. You know, you deal with the anxiety of being on film and what people will say, and how people will react and, and what will happen and all that shit, it just comes with it. Again, I'm just, I'm just truly grateful for these guys and all you out there watching, because again, you guys have helped build this brand into something bigger than I ever thought it could possibly be. When I go places and people are wearing my shirts or I hear top shelf or whatever, like that will always be crazy to me because again, I, I feel like I'm like the most normal human being. I just want everything to be normal. It's just crazy to see sometimes that, you know, when people come in, what they say to us and even, you know, when I go places and they're like, oh, where's Bruin? Where's Jordan? Where are they at? Where's your table? Like all that stuff is just awesome to see that we have all this support from all you guys. And it wouldn't have came without all this hard work from myself and Berwin and Jordan and Jake and, any, and everyone else who's helped in the past as well, right? We've had people who have been here and uh, things have worked out. Some things haven't worked out. We've grown apart, whatever. But uh, yeah, you know, it's just another day. I'm happy to, you know, be around another year getting old. I'm just truly grateful for where I'm at and as stressful again as it's been the last couple of weeks because it really has been. You know, I guess I wouldn't want it any other way, right? Uh, you got to work hard to achieve goals. And I feel like we're kind of working hard every day and kind of chipping away at it. I don't want to keep you guys much longer. I have no idea what's in this box. Let's see what's in it. All right, well, it's not that big at least. Is it a Corvette? A Mustang? <laughs> Some more shopping bags. <laughs> right? <laughs> box, box. You might need that again. Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> this from me like something that i used to do i feel like i do this to like lisa all the time gives oh here we go i already take not probably take this free it's not fun fact the more you know oh <laughs> So you said it recently, it was like, yeah, I just bought some headphones. Nothing crazy, just like some cheap kind. <laughs> and I was just like, so I was like, in, my, in the back of my head, I was just like, I like, you know, I'm gonna I'm a, I'm a spin back on that. And Barwin has the same headphones too. It's one of the Fire best ones. It's really, really like, it's it's better than Beats. It's honestly better than the Apple um, AirPods. Like, really? that's one of the best ones, honestly. Yeah, I really like, like them. You know, I remember when I, we, we did reviews for Berwin. So that's like the top one. It's super light, super comfortable. Mm -hmm. It's wireless. You know, I just feel like when you're editing and stuff like that, it's important to hear everything, especially at a sneaker show. You know what I'm saying? So I just feel like you could use that. You know, you're on a plane, you don't feel yeah. like getting bothered. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's so no, um, I appreciate it. I just feel like that's something you could really use. It is. It is. Because those $35 headphones <laughs> were really worth 15 bucks, weren't really the best. Like, <laughs> and that's what's up, man. I appreciate you guys. Yeah, yeah. anytime, anytime. Hell man. yeah. Oh, God. Another year, ladies and gents, another year, another day, another dollar. Again, can't thank these guys enough. Can't thank you guys out there enough for watching all this content, all the comments, all the likes, all the shares, all the good word of mouth. I'm truly super appreciative of it. As I get older, obviously, you know, I get more and more appreciative of it because I can't do this forever, right? We're all not gonna be here forever being able to do sneakers and all this stuff. So it's just awesome to see. We're still thriving, we're still buying, we're still selling and trading. We got so many shoes, so overwhelmed, too much stuff going down. Don't have a candle because I don't smoke but Dang. one a two, two a one two three happy birthday to you cha 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 happy birthday to you cha 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 happy birthday dear ad cha 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 happy birthday to you guys didn't know purple is one of his favorite colors that's why this purple icing mm. Thank you guys, I appreciate it. Yeah man, not really much more to say. It was a good Friday. Happy that we're getting out of here on time pretty much. Again, shouts to the guys for uh, working really hard today. Obviously making my birthday uh, an awesome day as well, but just working really hard. We've been working really hard these last couple of days. I'm hoping to maybe take just like a day or night off this weekend, you know, pick my feet up. If I can't do that, it's cool because again, we're really blessed to have this store.
and this brand and the supporters out there you guys are just keeping the motivation strong keeping us going so we greatly appreciate all y'all out there watching thank you so much for all the support and that's about it man i guess we're gonna eat some cake get out of here right one and done <laughs> did i did i take that? i don't remember but you gotta do the one i done. took it on two nah, right? nah, 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 nah. <laughs> wow. this pressure, man. Wow. i want some practice shots <laughs> It's a one shot. and done. It's a one and done. We don't switch it up. We don't switch it up. So you know this unedited footage here, guys. Again, thank you guys. Another year. See you guys tomorrow. And hopefully tomorrow we'll get more content. Maybe I'll do a little more buying and uh, we'll have both stores open. It'll be great. <sighs> I feel like I'm under pressure right now. I'm already dropping the pass here. All right, guys. <laughs> one and done. The birthday special. 2024. The Griffey year. Ooh. Not the Kobe year. The Griffey year. Anyway, catch you guys tomorrow. Till next time. Oh! <laughs> what is good? We're back, and we have a nice batch of orders to end the week off. We definitely have a little bit of a UNC vibe going on here. We got the UNC fives brand new, UNC sixes used, and then UNC fours brand new with no box. Two brand new playoffs going out. Obviously, you know we're stocked with those, so glad to see it. Gratitude elevens, GS size going out brand new, as well as a Jubilee brand new size nine and a half. Royal toes, another sneaker that just went down in value dramatically. But hey, our loss is your gain. Craft one lows and then let's go to the air max little wave we got silver bullets classic that since the re-retro came out you can get those very affordably i think we sold those for about 190 or so 200 ship got the vapor max off white we've had those for quite a while a lot of people would press buy it now not pay make us offers not pay finally someone pressed buy it now and paid so shouts to you because getting a good pair there i think the lowest price on goat is what we sold that pair used and that pair's in way better condition we got the air max deluxe that's a pair i feel like doesn't get as much love as it should it's a very cool air max that just no one cares about we got the filas which i love selling pairs like that because obviously we know we can sell retros right we know we can sell yeezys and nike and stuff like that but when we can grab something that we don't know if we can sell it and then we can sell it that's great to see next to a four and a half or fifty which another pair that i don't think we can sell shouts to yao ming youth jersey right there and the essentials fear of god hoodie and that's what we got going out today jordan jacob burwin anything for the people about the orders or the weekend or anything a lot of blue a lot of blue mm -hmm. and a lot of black so i see blue and black but just the blue just kind of throwing me off right now but yeah shout out to everyone who purchased something some good buys there unc fives i think that's one of our best grs in the store since they released i remember at one point i know a was trying to buy a bunch of those at a sneaker show because you know that shoe just you know always just move well and specifically size 11 and it's funny because that's the size 11 really good shoe day unc six is not really doing too much for us the deluxe really nice air max talk about air max the silver bullets top five air max in my opinion super uncomfortable but again aesthetically looking it's up there man it's one of the best ones for sure just a beautiful sneaker and next to the off-white big max really happy about that one because like they said like the amount of people who made offers and wouldn't buy we had to cancel and relist and just all that no it was just really stressful so shout out to the person who finally paid we got essentials for a god hoodie the goat asian goat yao ming and so also like the documentary or something like that didn't know how much of an icon he really was like in, in like china and like all of asia like, he's literally like you know viewed as a goat even though he had a short career due to injuries and stuff like that but no, shout out to him. You know, the Fila is just great looking at those. We buy like a lot of varieties and I think that's something we pride ourselves on. So whenever we have something crazy like that sells, I think that really just toots our own horn to what we really buy and our aesthetic. So yeah, shout out to everyone you know, who bought something. And also shout out to the person who bought the GS69. Shout out to John for selling that to us. Looking over everything, definitely have to agree with Jordan on those silver bullets. Uh, I don't wear 97s personally, but I know a lot of people that do. And just with the, the re-release that they've done with those, I think that it's dropped the price. I know those were up there for a really long time. And so, I think they're, you know, slightly more affordable now. So I think it's a just classic uh, Air Max colorway. Off-white Vapor Maxes. Not a huge fan of them, but uh, I, that black colorway for me sells a lot easier than the white. The white one just gets, it yellows really easily like a lot of those off-whites do in general. The Vapor Maxes, that sole, you know, can get yellowed really easily as well. But overall, I just like that shoe a lot. Again, I wouldn't wear it, but it's a, it's a good shoe. And then just the University Blue Force. A and I talk about it sometimes when we're over at the new store about how, you know, that's the one on the shelf that a lot of people look at but they don't really pick up and buy because it's 
it's the price is, is is up there now you know if you if you have the means and you can buy it especially if it's i'm assuming that's pre-owned and no box as long as you're okay buying pre-owned stuff like a lot of people are you can definitely get a, a nice little discount on what would be a pretty expensive brand new price other than that you know I, they guys pretty much covered everything got my ollie watkins jersey on today good news is he already scored bad news is i got pulled over on the way here Damn. that's why i was late yeah uh so haven't got pulled over in jersey yet but got pulled over got smacked with that 200 dollars speeding ticket so that wasn't fun but it happens ollie watkins made me my money already so <laughs> i guess that that's just getting donated yeah i was ready to have a good day today you know saturdays are usually busy so we'll just get to it yeah i'm gonna start with the silver bullets just because i think i've owned that pair at least like four to five times different years currently own two different years of it right now it's to me it's just one of my top five air maxes like jordan said not the most comfortable air max but still nonetheless a classic i want to speak about these gs jordans just because ever since we moved to the new location a lot more gs stuff has been selling and it's great to see i just remember at the previous location it would be tough to move them and, and like we would uh, most likely pass on gs sizes but now that we're here we've been buying them up and they've been selling so that's great to see royal toes remember that was another shoe that used to sell a lot back at the old store but now it's like fumbled as far as price if you're looking for like a blue and black jordan one that's definitely a, a good one right there and those feelers are absolutely atrocious if you're out there and you bought those uh, shouts to you i could never see myself wearing those but teach your own and then shout out to the yell fellow asian he was one of the best players again like jordan said due to injury had to stop playing a shout out to him for making an impact for basketball nba culture and also his culture as well so shout out to yell i actually remember watching that game live where he got injured and he wouldn't listen to his coaches about staying out of the game and he went back in the game and i think that messed up his Damn. ankle or something like way worse or his knee or something like that i could be wrong but i'm like pretty sure that's what happened he uh he didn't believe in quitting that's for sure let's take this phone call or at it because i know it's just gonna be some spam but top shelf top shelf hello all right guys let's have a great saturday and see what happens I'm trying to sell trade sell okay how many one shoes i might do like store credit i think this one okay how much you want for your stuff so uh, yeah, so negotiable on this. I'm not that much negotiable on this because uh, barely yeah. use it like you know. So how much you want on those? 650 or negotiable? Say 650? 6 on me. 6 on that. To use? Pretty on the yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. For like 600, I might pass just because I feel like market on the no, size yeah, A is a lot lower. Yeah, that's but how much can you do for I mean, they're clean. Yeah, but. Yeah, so these I'll probably pass on. Yes, I think they're all friend those. Oh, you're firm at six. No, no, I'm not saying I'm Oh, firm. you said? Oh, no, I'm not firm. Because this one, yes, said you was a negotiable one. Yeah. I'm, no, oh. I just saw the market. The market went low now. Yeah, yeah they're at like six in this yeah. size. Uh, I mean, you want on these two. I don't know how much you guys bought from me. Because they did me wrong with this shoe. It's yellow. Yeah, no, not even that. Look, they did this. They put me the... You can't take it off? No, I could take it off, but when they put that, it's the size. What size is the shoe? Oh. Yeah, I didn't So what size is the shoe? As you know, Eleven. Rolls around okay. That makes sense. <laughs> and they didn't tell you that or nothing? No, like no because when I bought it, and I, I did it like a trade. Yeah. But did, like it wasn't mentioned in the description or nothing like that? The guy was like, oh, I have original box and everything. So Would you trade at? I think I traded for uh, Like online or in, like in store? No, in person. person, in person. Uh -huh. I probably want to be at four there. Yeah? Or you want to be at here? They're used and I saw more that they're good on it. Um, how much are you asking for me on those? What are you asking on them? They are yellow over there. Yeah, 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 that's what I think. 550. 550. No negotiable too. Is this your pair on GOAT or no? Oh, yeah, so the guy. You put them up on GOAT? No, I didn't put them up on GOAT. So the four here. Do you do 440 in this? I want to be at like four, honestly. Market is six. Um, these I'll probably be at three for these. Mm -hmm. Those I'll probably just pass on. Just no box. Makes it a little bit harder to sell. And then yellow. How much is store quick can I get for this? I'll just pass on those. Just pass. Yeah. So you said three on this, way. Three, four. Does it highest? Mm-hmm. How you shop them around? Mm -hmm. How you shop these around? I guess I just bought it. How you want to sell it? Because it doesn't fit me. Mm. And the box is way smaller, and I, I never thought that Charles Scott and box would be that small. Because I also have a size 10, but the box is like this. Mm. Mm. Can you sell it 20 at least for both? 
Um, 410, 410. What could you get rid of it? How did you use it? You think you could do a stock right here? Those or not? You just kind of don't really want right now. And we got a we got a bunch back there just chilling yeah. that we just we literally just bought. So I'll probably just hold off. All right. On the ease for now. You said uh, 720? Yeah. All right, what's the best way? Sell. Here. You trying to trade sell? I think uh, a little bit of both. Did you see anything online? Yeah, I had to screenshot of some of the stuff. What'd you see? Um, there's a couple of Yeezys, 10 and a half, like 350s. Brand new used? Oh, uh, they were used. Okay. Most of it was all used. Stuff, yeah. okay, that's... Um, Like 75, I'll say 150 and see where you're at. And then these are just, I'm on the fence, I don't know, but just wanted to see where you're at. 75, 150 on the fence. Let me see what I can do for you. So, Palominos, I'll probably be at like a buck. The dunks, dunks, I'll probably be at like 50. And the off whites, I'll just have to look into. I feel like I haven't had this shoe in a while. Well, at least this colorway you haven't had in a while. Yeah, there wasn't much on the eBay. You want to use some in stock. We've been getting the black a lot. I was kind of thinking like 250. Yeah, so we got four. I have a brand new pair, that's why I'm like. You got two from us? Yeah. Only one. Yeah, both of them. I, I just, I just don't know if I'll ever actually wear them again. But yeah, let me know what you're thinking. Let me know, let me know what you want. I'm trying to think. Mm -hmm. You said for the, the reimagined, you probably be like 150. Like 150, 175, like in that range. I just gotta see them, honestly. Yeah. But if you're saying like you want one time, pretty clean, I would assume. So I just I did not have a box either. Oh, no box. I got them. I mean, yeah, I got them here. Uh, I'm trying to think. No, they do have the insoles. Yeah. Hmm. Um. Can you take my box? That's not how it works. <laughs> 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 yeah. So trade that, that those prices were traded or just cash when you gave me on these? Uh, cash, but what, like, what are you interested? In? Like, I'll, I'll take yeah. I'll knock I'll knock prices down on shit that you're trying to get. To I think much. for right now these. Uh huh. I'll keep the off whites. I'm gonna keep the off whites. Um, and then I'll bring the I'll bring my other things back a little bit later. Let's see what else? I'll browse the eBay again. Throw 25 on top. I was gonna say that. That's good. Yeah. They just have uh, no box. That, that's the only problem. But let me grab that for you. It's back there. I mean, just look at it. You know, you don't have to buy it. Just take a look. It had DJ shirt. Or like it just sit in your closet. How much for that? Let me see what I have it up for. I'll do 25 on it. So just demo you 50? Yep. That's cool with me. You want a replacement box for the threes? Um, no, nah, that's alright. Okay. Yep. I'll awesome. probably yeah. stop by later and bring the threes that don't fit and just Are you gonna want the Yeezys later too? Uh I don't know. I'm gonna take another look at the eBay and see what's good. Yeah, we can like we can ask stuff by then too, so uh, like I said, we have a bunch of new Yeezys that we just got in. Got some Yeezy slides too, so if you see anything, just let us know. Right. All right. All right. All right, bro. How are you doing, guys? Be good. Oh, that's a goal tennis. What's going on, man? All right, what we got today? Goal tennis. What's up, this stuff? Okay. Hey, hey, nice. We're gonna be moving out. Let's move out the way. Okay. Look at what this one is. I want man. I had a watch in the window. Oh, did you say jump ship? Did you offend a Cromart who Cromarty? No, it's the same guy. Chargers fans just jump ship? It's not like he could sell it anywhere else. Nobody's yeah, saying. he jump ship. <laughs> By wife right now. Every time you, know, you like sell stuff, we're like, you're just going to go back. Are you looking for XL? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, some of them are like large XL. Yeah, it is. I hope it's a green. Yeah, yeah. I'm tired of seeing it. No, no. Oh, my God. I'm like, everyone got the purple. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
hit on the coach yet. Yeah. 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 These are my favorite ones. Yeah. Yeah. So what you asking for this stuff? For this stuff right here. Six stuff. So this stuff right here? Like 720. 20. This one at 260. Any reimagined? What size? That's that 10, 10 and a half. I believe so. What? I think we have both. I don't do it uh, size swap. I got one in my car. On, what size you have? I got a nine. Okay, and you want to what size? Um, let me try the ten. I mean, I'm kind of big, right? Uh, yeah. You have the SB fours? No, I'm still trying to get those. I'm gonna say you have SB fours. Give me one second first before we do this one. He bought it. This is good. Good money. The ten? Yeah. What you see? Man, if some of the stuff was XL, Seven, I would have cashed yeah, that. That's like here, four. Cool yeah, right. Right. Yeah. I appreciate yeah. that. Thank you. All right. I got four. Okay. What you I want for the core purples? I want two six of each. Let me see. The feet. I see they dipped. I'll probably be around like two for them. All these. Yeah, I'll take these. 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 I'll for this next one, okay. and I'll do the um, trace well, side swipe for these. We'll get the other one. Okay, okay. You want to for the Kobe's yeah, again? I feel like two, honestly. They don't like, they're like two, four, and six. We got like three, we haven't even sold one yet, so. All right, yeah. But yeah, I mean, look around. I don't know if you want to particular, but uh, let me know. I feel like for a size swap, it would be like like 30 for the size swap. That's cool. That's cool. Mm -hmm. I bet. I'll run that. And then, just give you 370? Yeah. You got, uh, got any more beanies? Yeah, I do. So we owe you 345. That's cool. Okay. You want a bag or you want to use your bag? Let me use my bag. All right, cool. Um, 345. Uh, is that all right? You got cash? Uh, oh, yeah. Let me see. I like you guys' YouTube channel. Oh, thank you, man. Appreciate it. First time here? Yes, sir. Oh, where are you from? Nutley. Oh, not too far. My ex-girlfriend used to live right across the street. <laughs> <laughs> so the irony of it. And is everything used new? So the only thing that's dust stock is the, the Crocs. Crocs. Yeah. Everything else is. Uh, I can tell you the cement threes. I wore them three times. Mm -hmm. That's it. I have the original receipt in there. Uh, Georgetown. I wore like two times. And how much were you looking for your stuff? Let's see what the number we come in between, and I'll tell you. Yeah, I see. I have it on my phone already. What number? I'm okay. That. What's that number? Uh, realistic, it was four oh five, but I'll, I'll co. Yeah, I'll, I'll co work with you. Okay. Let me see. Just, just. Look. I was gonna clean the cement threes for you, but I was like, ah. Oh, there you go, bro. I didn't know they dropped this color. Yeah, the camel. Yeah. Nice. And then you said you wanted 405, right? Yeah. Okay. So we're not too far yeah. off, honestly. I'm just double checking this market. And then we could talk about breakdown of how we think each one is, and then. Yeah, for yeah, sure. I was at 375. Oh, wow. Yeah. So, so we're really close. I'm not even like 30 dollars off. Yeah. Really. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So again, like trade wise, I'll, I'll come up with the stuff and I'll drop. Really? Yeah. Price on it. If you saw something, just yeah. let me just let me know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if you're looking for anything specifically, or you just want to browse around to see what we have. Um, you think you could do 390 cash and then we could if trade I mean or if credit if I um, I could do like 380 cash I come right. up an extra five for you yeah that's you no problem that? yeah that's no problem I'm, I'm not gonna you know bust your balls on it <laughs> and like I said like if you see something like I said I'll work I'll work with you you know what I'm saying just let me know if you find anything yeah yeah we're definitely. Go um, yeah. what size are 10 so 10 you'll be on this side are you nine and a half ten or ten ten and a half 
Um, I'm just I'm day 10. Yeah, I'm okay. true. I don't know if you can tell, but it's been a quite hectic day. We have way too much going on. When it rains, it pours. Everyone got to go home early today, so we're just going to call it a day for Saturday. Shout out to everyone who pulled up. Shout out to everyone for watching. Shout out to the dude coughing. And I uh, just love all y'all. And uh, I'm not taking the one and done because I made my birthday one and done yesterday. You know what's going on, so that leaves Burn with the one and done. It's Jordan. Oh. I'm fucking tired, honestly. I'm drained. One and done. Catch you guys next week. Someone just came by, so let me hurry up. Oh! Peace. <laughs>